Hello, how are you today? Now, first, Marie is in France. Now, we have Isabel. Isabel is from France. Isabel, this is Ali. Nice to meet you, Ali. Nice to meet you, too. And this is Lisa. Nice to meet you, Lisa. Nice to meet you, too, Isabel. Great. So, Lisa, how are you today? Fine, thanks. And you? I'm great. And Ali, how's it going? Great. And Isabel, what's up? Not much. And you? I'm okay. Now, today, we're going to learn more English. We're going to talk about people. First, we're going to learn adjectives about looks and personality. Adjectives. Looks. Now, an adjective, an adjective gives information about a noun. Adjective plus noun. Now, these are nouns. Teacher. Teacher. Student. Student. Book. Book. And pen. Pen. Teacher, student, book, pen. Now these are nouns. Adjectives give information about the nouns. They come before the nouns and after some verbs. Look. Here's teacher. Here's the noun. My nice teacher. My nice is the adjective. My nice teacher and teacher is the noun. My nice teacher. And here's a sentence. She is my nice teacher. She is my nice teacher. Now here's another example. Student. Student is the noun. Her good student. Her good student. Good is the adjective, student is the noun. Her good student. Here's a sentence. I am her good student. I am her good student. Now, one more example. This one is plural. Students, her good students. This is the adjective, her good students. This is the noun, her good students. Here's the sentence, we are her good students. We are her good students. All right? Here's another one. Book. Book. These big books. These big books. Big is the adjective. Books is the noun. These big books. Here's a sentence. These are big books. These are big books. Now, I want you to notice that the adjective does not change for singular. Okay, this is one. 
good student or good students. All right, this is one, maybe two. Good student, good students. No change. Now, let's learn some vocabulary about how a person looks. Okay, first, short, medium height, and tall. Short, medium height, and tall. Here we go. This is for size. Heavy, heavy, medium, slim, and thin. Heavy, medium, slim, thin. Heavy, medium, slim, and thin. Okay? Now, here's some more. Handsome. Handsome. Handsome is only for men. Handsome. And beautiful. Beautiful. Beautiful is only for women. Handsome, beautiful. Now, another one is pretty. Pretty also is only for women. Pretty. Now, we have good looking. Good looking. Good looking is for women and for men. Oops, got her hair. Good looking. And we have ugly. Ugly for women and men. Good looking, ugly. Now, here's some other ones. Strong and weak. Strong and weak. Strong, weak. Next. Dark, dark, light. Dark, light. And finally we have Young, middle-aged, and old. Young, middle-aged, old. Adjectives to be. Now, let's review the be verbs. Be, all right? Now, let's look at the monitor. Here we go. I am short. I'm. I am Molly. I'm Molly. You are. You're. You are Ali. You are Ali. He is. He's. He is Tom. He's Tom. She is. She's. She is Marie. She's Marie. It is. It's. It is Dolly. It's Dolly. We are. We're. We are students. We're students. You are. You're. You are students. You're students. And they are, there. They are students. They are students. Now, we're going to change it a little bit. And we're going to do a lot. Here we go. First of all, basic, short, and two examples.
Okay, now, what we're going to do is make sentences with adjectives. So, basic, I am short, I'm. Now, I am tall. I am tall. Short, I'm tall. Okay? I am, I'm, I am tall, I'm tall. Now, let's do it with you. You are, you are, you're, you're, you are tall, you are tall, and you're tall. You are, you're, you are tall, you're tall. Okay, now, with he is, he's, sentence, he is tall, and he's tall. He is, he's, he is tall, he's tall. And of course, we can do the same with she. She is, she's, she is tall. She is tall, she's tall. She is, she's, she is tall, she's tall. And we can do it with it, is, it is, it's, it is tall, and it's tall. It is, it's, it is tall, it's tall. Next. We are, we're, we are tall, we are tall, and we're tall. We are, we're, we are tall, we're tall. Now, you are, you know this, you're, you are tall, you are tall, and you're tall. You are, you're, you are tall, you're tall. And finally, we have they are there. They are tall. They are tall. They're tall. They are there. They are tall. They're tall. Let's look at it on the monitor again, and you can see. I am, I am, I'm. I am tall, I'm tall. You are, you're, you are tall, you're tall. He is, he's, he is tall, he's tall. She is, she's, she is tall. She's tall. It is. It's. It is tall. It's tall. We are. We're. We are tall. We're tall. You are. You're. You are tall. You're tall. And they are. 
there. They are tall. They're tall. Now, I want you to look at these pronouns. We have the possessive pronouns and the subject pronouns. First, we have my and I. I. Your, you. His, he. Her, she. It's, it. Our, we. Your, you. And their, they. Okay? Now, this is one way we can make a sentence about a person. Let me show you. Okay. So, here we go. Ali is, is, good looking. Ali is good looking. Ali is good looking. Lisa is tall. Lisa is tall. Lisa is tall. Marie is pretty. Marie is pretty. Marie is pretty. They are medium height. They are medium height. They are medium height. We are thin. We are thin. We are thin. Okay, now let's practice. And I want you to look at the photos and tell me about the person. Now, Isabel. He is short. Uh, he is good looking. Good. Now, Lisa. Look at this picture and tell me about this person. He is handsome. He is tall. He is dark. Good. Now, Ali. She is good looking. She is tall. She is young. Good. Very good. Personality. Now, let's talk about personality. We're going to talk about personal characteristics. First, here is some vocabulary. Funny. 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 Serious. 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 Nice. 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 Polite, polite, polite. Rude, rude, rude. Smart, smart, smart. Intelligent, intelligent, intelligent. Shy, shy, shy. Quiet, quiet, quiet. And outgoing, outgoing, outgoing. Now, we can make sentences the same way, but we can add and. Let's add and. This is the same as plus. Okay? So, we can write funny plus smart. He is funny and smart. 
He is funny and smart. Funny and smart. Here's another example. Good looking. Nice. She is good looking and nice. She is good looking and nice. Now, let's practice and I will give you the information and you make the sentences. Are you ready? Okay, first Lisa. He tall, strong. Okay. He is tall and strong. Good. Now Ali. She short, smart. She is short and smart. Mm-hmm. Great. Okay, Isabel. They shy, pretty. They are shy and pretty. Mm-hmm. Very good. Lisa. We funny, rude. We are funny and rude. All right. Isabel, you smart, polite. You are smart and polite. Yes. Good. And Ali, I tall, dark. I am tall and dark. Yes. And finally, Lisa, you thin, beautiful. You are thin and beautiful. Oh, yes. Now, I want you to look and listen. Look and listen. I am tall. She is short. We are good looking. They are smart. You are nice and pretty. He is funny and outgoing. Read and repeat. Adjectives, sentence structure. Okay, now we're going to talk about sentence structure in English. Sentence structure. Now, in English, the verb usually comes after the subject. Subject and then the verb. There's always a subject and a verb in English sentences. Now, here is one sentence. You are young. You are young. Subject is you. You. Verb is are. And the complement, the complement is young. Now, this again, you are young, subject you, verb are, complement young. Now, this sentence means you young. You are young. Okay? You are young. Here's another example. He is tall. He is tall. The subject, he. He. Verb, is. And the complement, tall. He is tall. Now, again, this means he is tall. Same. Okay? 
Now, tall completes the noun. Now, let's practice. Okay, here's a sentence. We are smart. Okay, Ali, in this sentence, what is the subject? We. And what is the verb? Are. And what is the complement? Smart. Smart. Yes. Okay, now, say the sentence. We are smart. Yes, you are. Now, Lisa, here's one for you. I am polite. Okay, Lisa, what is the subject? I. What is the verb? Am. And what is the complement? Polite. Okay, now say the sentence. I am polite. I am polite. Yes, you are polite. Now, Isabel, here is the last one. They are tall and good-looking. They are tall and good-looking. What is the subject? They. What is the verb? Are. And what is the complement? Tall and good-looking. Good girl. Tall and good-looking. Very good. Now say the sentence. They are tall and good-looking. Now, I want you to complete these sentences. I will write part of the sentence. And you finish it. Okay. Lisa? I am rude. I am rude. No, you aren't rude, Lisa. Okay, Isabel, let's do one for you. Isabel. You are nice. Yes, you are nice. Thank you. And Ali, for you. He is handsome. Yes. He is handsome. Handsome is only for men. Good. Now, Isabel. Isabel? She is pretty. She is pretty. Pretty is only for women. Okay. Now, Ali, one for you. A long one. We okay. are medium height and thin. Okay, again, Ali? We are medium height and thin. Yes, we are medium height and thin. Good, okay, and finally, Lisa. Another long one. Okay, Lisa. They are intelligent and serious. They are intelligent and serious. Good. You are very smart. Now, let's make these negative. It's very easy. You just add not. Okay? There are two short ways to do it, and let's look at the monitor, and you can see them. Now, I am not tall. I'm not tall. You are not tall. You are not tall. You aren't tall. He is not tall. He's not tall. He isn't tall. She is not tall. She's not tall. She isn't tall. It is not tall. It's not tall. It isn't tall. We are not tall. We're not tall. We aren't tall. You are not tall. You are not tall. You aren't tall. And they are not tall. They're not tall. They aren't tall. Okay? Now, let's also make some questions. 
Now again, we have the question, and the positive, and the negative answer. So here we go. The question, positive answer, and two possibly negative answers. So positive, negative, and question. Now, here we go. First question. Am I tall? Now, here we have the verb and the subject switched. Yes, you are. Am I tall? Yes, you are. Or negative, no, you're not. No, you aren't. Same. These are the same. Am I tall? Yes, you are. Am I tall? No, you're not. Am I tall? No, you aren't. Now, let's continue. Are you tall? Are you tall? Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Or, no, I'm not. Okay, with I, there's only one. Are you tall? Yes, I am. Are you tall? No, I'm not. Okay, here we go. Is he tall? Yes, he is. You see this? Is he tall? Yes, he is. Or, no, he's not. No, he isn't. Is he tall? Yes, he is. Is he tall? No, he's not. Is he tall? No, he isn't. Now, we can do the same thing with she. Is she tall? Yes, she is. Is she tall? No, she's not. Is she tall? No, she isn't. Okay? Is she tall? Yes, she is. Is she tall? No, she's not. Is she tall? No, she isn't. And, of course, we can do, this is the quick way, uh, is it tall? Is it tall? Yes, it is. Is it tall? No, it's not. Is it tall? No, it isn't. Okay? Is it tall? Yes, it is. Is it tall? No, it's not. Is it tall? No, it isn't. Now, there's more. Are we tall? Are we tall? Yes, we are. Or, yes, you are. Yes, you are. Are we tall? Yes, we are. Are we tall? Yes, you are. And of course, negative. No, we are not. No, we aren't. No, you're not. And no, you aren't. Okay? Are we tall? Yes, we are. Are we tall? No, we're not. No, we aren't. Are we tall? Yes, you are. Are we tall? No, you're not. No, you aren't. Okay. Keep going here. And then the next one is, are you tall? Now, we saw this before. Are you tall? Yes, we are. No, 
we're not. Or, no, we aren't. Are you tall? Yes, we are. Are you tall? No, we're not. No, we aren't. Okay, and the last one. Are they tall? Are they tall? Yes, they are. Yes, they are. No, they're not. No, they aren't. Are they tall? Yes, they are. Are they tall? No, they're not. No, they aren't. Okay, now let's look at these on the monitor and see how they look. Okay, here we go. Am I tall? Yes, you are. No, you're not. No, you aren't. Are you tall? Yes, I am. No, I'm not. Is he tall? Yes, he is. No, he's not. No, he isn't. Is she tall? Yes, she is. No, she's not. No, she isn't. Is it tall? Yes, it is. No, it's not. No, it isn't. Are we tall? Yes, we are. No, we are not. No, we aren't. Or, are we tall? Yes, you are. No, you're not. No, you aren't. Are you tall? Yes, we are. No, we're not. No, we aren't. And finally, are they tall? Yes, they are. No, they're not. No, they aren't. Okay? Now, let's practice. Lisa, are you tall? Yes, I am. Ali, are you and Isabel polite? Yes, we are. Isabel, is Tom Cruise handsome? Yes, he is. Ali, is Julia Roberts beautiful? Yes, she is. Lisa, is Madonna beautiful? Mm, no, she isn't. Okay. Isabel, is Ali rude? No, he isn't. He is polite. Mm -hmm. Ali, are you, Lisa, and Isabel smart? Yes, we are. Yes, you are. Okay. Ali, make some negative sentences about Sean Penn. He is not handsome. He is not tall. Okay. Lisa, make some negative sentences about Meg Ryan. She's not Sorry. shy. She is not ugly. Good. Now, Isabel, make some negative sentences about Bill Clinton. He is not short. He is not old. Mm -hmm. Very good. All right. Now, we're going to talk a little bit more about description. We're going to talk about a person's hair. Hair. Okay? Now, we can say long, short, and medium. Long, short, medium. Long, short, and medium. Okay. Now, we can also say curly, curly, and straight. Straight. Curly and straight. Next, we can talk about colors. Brown, black, red, blonde, and gray. Okay? Brown, 
black, red, blonde, and gray. Now, we can also talk about hair for a man. We have a mustache, a mustache, a beard, and bald, bald, mustache, a mustache, beard, a beard, and bald. Okay? Now, this is what we say. She has mm -mm, hair. Her hair is mm -mm. same information. For example, she has long hair. She has long hair. Her hair is long. She has long hair. Her hair is long. Okay, now here is another example. I have short red hair. I have short red hair. My hair is short and red. My hair is short and red. Okay, now you tell me about your hair. Lisa? I have long brown hair. My hair is long and brown. Okay. Isabel? I have long, straight, brown hair. My hair is long and straight and brown. Mm -hmm. Okay. Ali? I have short brown hair. My hair is short and brown. Okay. Now, this is how we use some of the other vocabulary. He has a mustache. He has a mustache. He has a beard. He has a beard. He is bald. He is bald. Now, usually these are only for men. Now, look at these photos and tell me about the hair. Isabel. He has short blonde hair. He has a mustache. Very good. Okay, Lisa. This photo? She has long curly red hair. Mm-hmm. Good. Ali. She has short straight black hair. Mm-hmm. Yes, good. Okay, Lisa. This photo? He has long black hair. He has a beard. He has a mustache. Yes, good. Now, Isabel, this photo. He is bald. He has a mustache. Yes. Ali, this is the last photo. She has short, curly, brown hair, no mustache. Ha, ha, ha. Very funny. All right. Now, let's look and listen. Look and listen. He has short curly hair. His hair is short and curly. Her hair is long and straight. She has long straight hair. We have black hair. Our hair is black. He is bald. Read and repeat. Now, here are some photos, 
and I want you to tell three sentences about them. So Ali, you start. They are old. He is bald. She has short gray hair. Mm -hmm. Okay, now Isabel. He is young and smart. He has short red hair. Mm -hmm. Good. Now Lisa. She is serious. She is good looking. She has black hair. Great. Very good. Now, I want to talk more about description, about the eyes. This is very important. Okay? We're going to talk about the eyes. First, there's big, big eyes. Big eyes. And small. Small eyes, small eyes. Now, we can also talk about color. Brown, brown eyes, brown eyes. Black, black eyes, black eyes. Blue, blue eyes, blue eyes. Gray, gray eyes, gray eyes, and green, green eyes, green eyes. Now, this is what we say. He has blue eyes. I have blue eyes. Okay? He has blue eyes. I have blue eyes. All right? Now, let's practice. Ali, tell me about your eyes. I have blue eyes. All right. Isabel. I have green eyes. Lisa. I have brown eyes. All right. So Lisa has brown eyes. Ali has blue eyes. And Isabel has green eyes. Ali, my eyes? You have blue eyes. Yes, I do. Now it's time to look and listen. Look and listen. You have blue eyes. I have brown eyes. You have big green eyes. Read and repeat. All right. Now, we've seen many adjectives. Some of these adjectives can have opposites. Opposites. Now, look, short, short, tall, short, tall, thin, thin, heavy, heavy, thin, heavy, handsome for a man, Handsome and ugly. Handsome, ugly. Now we have beautiful or pretty for women and ugly. Beautiful or pretty, ugly. Good looking. For men or women, and again, ugly. Good looking, ugly. Now we have strong, strong, and weak. Strong and weak. Dark and light. Dark 
and light. And finally, we have young and old. Young and old. Now, these are for some, how someone looks. Now, I want you to tell me the opposites for these personal characteristics. So, let's start with you. Ali, funny. Uh, funny, serious. Mm-hmm, good. Lisa, polite. Polite, rude. And Isabel, shy. Shy, outgoing. Adjectives, but. Now, let's look at another kind of sentence. This one is with but. But. But means different. Now, look at this sentence. She is smart, but shy. She is smart, but shy. Smart, shy. She is smart, but shy. Here's another one. He is short, but strong. He is short, but strong. Short, strong. He is short, but strong. Now, let's practice a little bit. I want you to tell me something about you with but. So, Ali. I am handsome, but shy. Yeah, so really. Okay, Lisa. I am young, but smart. Yes. Now, Isabel. I am serious, but polite. Yes, that's right. Very good. Now, look and listen. Look and listen. He is tall, but quiet. She is pretty, but shy. We are young, but smart. You are intelligent, but funny. Read and repeat. We'll practice more with but in another lesson, but now we're going to do some review. And here are some questions we can ask. What does he look like? What does he look like? He is tall and handsome. What does he look like? He is tall and handsome. Here's another question. What is he like? What is he like? His personality. He is nice. What is he like? He is nice. All right, now. I'll, uh, Lisa, what does Ali look like? Okay. He has short brown hair. He is handsome. He has blue eyes. And what is he like? He is quiet but nice. Okay. Isabel, what does Lisa look like? She is tall but pretty. She has long brown hair. She has brown eyes. And what is she like? She is smart but funny. Great. Now, Ali, what does Isabel look like? She is tall but beautiful. She has straight brown hair. Her hair is long. She has big green eyes. Yes, she does. And what is she like? She is shy but intelligent. Very good. Now, 
Listen and write. Listen and write. Now, listen and write. Write these letters. Number one. H, A, N, D, S, O, M, E. Number two. P, R, E, T, T, Y. Number three. B, E, A, U, T, I, F, U, L. Number four. P, O, L, I, T, E. Number five. Q, U, I, E T. Now check your work. H A N D S O M E. Number two. P R E T T Y. Number three. B E A U T I F U L. Number four. P O L I T E. Number five. Q U I E T. Now. Listen and write these sentences. Number one. We are good looking. Two. They are strong but rude. Number three. He is tall and dark. Number four, I am beautiful but smart. Number five, she is quiet and polite. Now check your work. Number one, we are good looking. Number two, they are strong but rude. Number three, he is tall and dark. Number four, I am beautiful but smart. Number five, she is quiet and polite. Now, read this story and answer the questions about it. Read and answer. <laughs> Anne is a student. Her first name is Anne. Her last name is Smith. She is 22 years old. She is medium height and pretty. She has short, curly, blonde hair. She has blue eyes. She is quiet but funny. Nice to meet you, Anne. Now answer the questions. Number one. What is her last name? Number two. How old is she? Number three. Is she tall? Number four. Is her hair long and straight? Number five. Is she quiet? Now, check your answers. Number one, what is her last name? Her last name is Smith. Number two, how old is she? 
She is 22 years old. Number three, is she tall? No, she isn't. She is medium height. Number four, is her hair long and straight? No, it isn't. It's short and curly. Number five, is she quiet? Yes, she is. Okay, students, see you soon. Practicing English. So, Alexi, how's your work going? Do you like your colleagues? It's going very well. My colleagues are very fine, and it's fun to be with them. I'm glad for you. It's very important to have nice people at work. What about your boss? Do you like him? Well, he's smart and funny, and that makes him easy to work with. Who are your other colleagues? Well, there is one colleague. Her name is Lisa Hawkins. What does she look like? Hmm. She's hard to describe. Let's see. She's tall, and she has red hair. She's very serious, never smiles. She always wears black, and her skin is very white. She's not very interesting. Oh, that's too bad. I have one colleague who always wears a red tie. He has long hair and earrings. He is very smart. Do you like him? He's a good teacher, but he doesn't have a lot of patience with his students. He is angry every day. Oh, oh no. He is serious, but he is a good teacher. Okay. Hey. Hi. Did you guys see Jack? I haven't seen him all day. His niece Stephanie is here from Germany. Ah, does she have blonde hair? Yes, she does. She has blue eyes and is wearing a denim jacket and black jeans with a red shirt. How long is her hair? Is it curly? Yes, it's curly and medium length. Is that her? No, 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 no. This girl has a beautiful smile. Her teeth are straight, white. Her smile is just amazing. Sam, you sound like you're in love. Well, she's very sweet. I, w I want to get to know her better. Well, why don't you talk to Jack? Isn't he your best friend? He helps you. Come on, guys. I'm a shy guy. I can't talk to Jack about her. And why would you want to talk to a guy like me? Sam, you're a great guy. You're smart, fun to be with, and I hear girls say all the time how they love your green eyes. That's right, Sam. Don't be shy. There's nothing wrong with asking a girl out for a drink. Sam, you're a very sweet guy. You're good looking, handsome, and you're fun to be with. Uh, I don't know, guys. Meeting a new girl, someone pretty like Stephanie, I'm very shy and I don't know what to say. Come on, Sam. Just tell her she's very pretty and you would like to know her better. Well, I'll try to talk to her soon. Hey, everyone. The new Julia Roberts movie is opening tomorrow. Alexi and I want to see it. Do you want to come with us? Another pretty woman. Well, I'm not talking to Stephanie. I could at least see Julia Roberts. Her hair is long and wavy. Her smile is very bright. I love her movies. Yes, she is an attractive woman. I love her movies. But I always love her fun personality. She's famous in Greece, too. <laughs>